Oh boy, what we have here. Hello, this is Alice the Dragon, and I like showing off my games, so here's Stardew Valley. Yay! I have played quite a bit of Star Stardew Valley. Um, I've got two saves already in the mix there, but let's start a new game. Ooh, standard farm, river, forest, hilltop, monsters. There's plenty of good land here, but beware, at night the monsters come out. I want monsters. And do I want a cat or a dog? I want to be a lady. Uh... You know what? I should pick dog because Bella's a dog. Aren't you, Bella? She's just sleeping over there. All right. Can I... I wonder if I could do... Alice the drag. <laughs> oh, I'm just going to do Alice. Okay. Uh, dragon farm. Favorite thing. Like, I really wish that they would specify a little bit more. But uh, let's see. Favorite thing. Favorite thing. Like... Silver. There we go. Uh, what kind of skin do I want? Wait, what was that? Ooh! <laughs> uh, that, that's, that's like super pale. Like, like vampire pale. I like it. Alright. Uh, nice sweep there. Hmm. 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 That's kind of nice. Uh, picking out a hairstyle. Why is it so hard? Spiky hair. I think I'll go with that sweep. Uh, my hair color. Not that super black. Maybe get a little bluish. Yeah. All right. Uh, I want which kind of shirt? That one's got a skull on it. Should I just go full goth? Mm, maybe not, but I wish uh, I wish there was a jumper in here. Cause I yeah I've got a couple of jumpers and I I really like them. Because then I can wear my scale print leggings with them and actually show them off. Oh, heart. Uh, da, 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 da. Decisions, decisions. Like, that's definitely the hardest part of starting a new game, is you have to decide on your look. Eh. Wait. Is that a rainbow belt buckle? It looks like a rainbow belt buckle. <laughs> That's kind of nice. Uh, hmm. Nice collar there. I don't think so. Mouse shirt. I could go with suspenders. That's that's kind of like a jumper. I like that. Uh, and. Pants color, pretty much the same as that, I guess. Accessories, <laughs> mustache. Can't even tell. Oh, that was the earrings. Glasses, lipstick, big shiny eyes, I guess. Eh, I don't need an accessory. Oops. There we go. Uh, eh, we'll do the intro. Why not? Yeah, I say I think I th I look all right, but I want to change the eye color real quick. Maybe a greenish, greenish, bluish, greenish. All right. Let us go to our new farm. 
Yeah, I can't really say I lived on a farm as a kid, but I did have chickens. And, uh, yeah, I had four hens and a rooster for my very special granddaughter. I want you to have the sealed envelope. Yes, take the sealed envelope. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now, listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Like right now? <laughs> and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. So the growing emptiness of existential dread. Yeah. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Uh, I am already uh, under so much pressure from let, living in the city. I'm going to let Grandpa rest and just immediately open that envelope. Right, here I am in my little cubicle, being all productive. One of my co-workers was terminated. They've, they've been doing some downsizing. Things are, things are tough. And, uh, and the boss, the new boss they brought in, uh, uh, he, he just, uh, he makes me sweat drop. <laughs> sweat drop? Drop sweat? Yes, let's open that envelope. Dear Alice, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Dragon Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Can do. Alright. I want to go to my new farm, cause city life sucks. There's too much traffic. And I don't even want to drive a car. If it were up to me, I wouldn't even own a car. I would just take the bus everywhere, just like this. And walk. I Woo! Stardew Valley, half a mile. Tweet, tweet, little bird. The one, the one thing I really want out of this... Okay, I'll just skip this part. All right. The one thing I really want out of this is to not check the wiki. <laughs> That's really... There we go. Got some parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. From the mayor himself. All right. Ah, uh, let... First thing to do is watch some TV. Let's see the fortune teller. Welcome back to Wellwick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you've come to the right place. The spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on your side. All right, so no fishing today. Not that I have a fishing pole. All right. Yes, I am well aware of the controls. It's probably not going to leave me alone until I do that. Okay, I forgot how just over uh, overgrown the farm is just starting out. I kind of wish that my mouse would work when I'm actually pressing the keys. 
but since it's the uh, touchpad, I think it's just set to uh, to turn off when uh, when I'm pressing a key, which you know is useful when you're writing stuff. Not so much when you're actually trying to, um, you know, play a video game. <laughs> All right. All right. I need to... I'm going to set up my garden as close to the water as I can. Now, where's some water? Because I don't want to have to walk a all over the place. Okay, yeah, all the way over there. Oh, well, let's. Just gonna put my mouse over here. That way it'll just keep swinging where I'm facing. That, that works a lot faster. I need some wood. Get that wood. Punching trees gives me wood. Yeah. All right. Get this tree too. There we go. Timber. Actually, I should be saying that while it's falling down, because the whole point of yelling timber is to warn everybody that a tree is falling down. Timber! See? Just like that. <laughs> Alright. There we go. And I'm just gonna let the grass grow as much as possible. Actually, I should be chopping this from the other side. I want it to fall away from the water, please. That is very nice, though, how we've got just this whole big uh, pond right in the middle of our farm. Because I've tried the, the default, I've tried the river, um, river thing, and I've uh, tried the... Uh, Actually, no. Uh, just the normal in the river. That's all I've done. Alright. I want to... Alright. Let's... Yeah. Just... Move a little bit of room. Just like that. Uh, parsnip mm -hmm. seeds. Uh... Very tired. Come on, I want to get the rest of these in. All right, I need to find a snack. So slow. Uh, I overdid it. I overdid it. Let's find some forage. Just something I can pick up off the ground and eat. So pale. <laughs> uh, like, I am almost that pale in, in real life. Almost. Come on, I just want to eat it. Come on. Can I eat it? Ah, I guess... Oh, that's odd. Oh, I guess I'll have to... keep looking, I guess? It says 25 energy, 10 health. 
but it, for some reason it's not letting me do anything with it. Yeah. Let's see, one of my first quests is to just get, yeah, it's getting, it's greeting everybody. Uh, need food. Wizard needs food. Alright. Maybe if I go down to the shop. I also need to figure out who I want my sweetheart to be. I might go after one of the ladies this time. Did I ever mention I'm bisexual? I totally am. Okay, okay. There we go. Let's go get some... Please tell me you have food. just uh, all these are seeds I could just get myself some rice all right all right just eat the rice please yes there we go that's what I needed it's not much but it's what I needed Let's greet some folks. Caroline! Hello, you must be Alice, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. Is that it? My husband runs the general store here. Have you met my daughter, Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. Oh, yeah. I like purple hair. Why, hello and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. I don't know if I'm going to do voices for everybody. I probably won't remember all of them anyway. Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting! Hello. Hi. Oh, did you want something? Well, geez. Thanks, Penny. Uh, let's see. If I go down here, will there be any forage this way? Because I want to have enough energy to water those parsnips. Oh, hello. Oh, you're that new farmer girl or whatever, aren't you? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. <laughs> uh, I would not go for Haley at all. There we go. Uh, dandelion forage. Oh, gotta go, gotta go meet the wizard. Wizard's this way. He lives in the tower and I... I'm going to meet him every day because, oh, is it, am I looking in the wrong spot or am I, or am I crazy? There it is. I am not crazy. Ah, it's still locked. Well, as soon as I'm able, I really want to... Uh, be friends with the wizard, cause the the wizard magicy stuff, like that is right up my alley. The last playthrough I did, I mostly went for fishing, but uh, you know, since I'm not checking the wiki at all, uh. Or at least, I don't want to check the wiki. 
Can we get through here without chopping any more? Uh, like I am just going to exhaust myself. Uh, nope. 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 And it's getting dark. Oh! That's what they meant by monsters. Ouch! Alright, alright. Monsters come out at night. Alright. Well, we weren't able to water the parsnips, but uh, we've got something... Uh, weather, Kozu5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast, sunny. I like sunny, although I prefer rainy, just in general. There we go. All right, let's go water those parsnips. We got mail. Yep, there's our fishing pole. Yep. Just had to check. Alright. So let's let's water these. Yeah. Nice hydration. I'm not really much of a gardener per se. I, I do I do enjoy landscaping, which is pretty much what I'm doing for my current job. But uh, when it comes to growing fruits and vegetables, eh, with with me it's kind of hit or miss. All right, let's uh, go out and meet some more people. More forage. Right. I'm going to want to gather up as much of that forage as possible. Yep. There we go. Anything else up here? No. Okay. Today's going to be an exploring day. Let's go meet some people. Yeah, get that daffodil. Okay, who's around? Who's around me? Oh, we could go for the loner. <laughs> go. What do you want? Go away! Oops. Like, I remember he likes pizza. So... If we get some pizza, that'd be nice. We also need to make sure to, you know, greet everybody on their birthdays. So Sunday is Lewis's birthday. So let's, let's just see. Let's see. Is it too early for the saloon? Yeah. Gotta wait until at least lunch. Okay, I go over and check out the smithies and uh, unlock the stuff there. Alright, for the museum, because of course we got to check out the museum. Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. Uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Can do. Nothing really to check out there, so... 
Oh, is that Penny? Oh, tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Yeah. Smithy dude. I just want to say hi to him. Er, hi. I'm Clint. I knew a Clint once. Nice guy. I really enjoyed hanging out with him. He was the brilliant mind behind the the first LARP I ever went to. It was uh, Werewolf the Apocalypse. A uh, Mind's Eye Theater White Wolf uh, production. So that was fun. I, uh, I played a Ragabash, which I don't think I... Ooh, blue hair. Blue hair. Wait, wait, come back. There we go. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. Maybe I should go for Emily. She's cute. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. It would be really easy to seduce Emily. If she works in the tavern, then uh, that's uh, definitely a thing. Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. <laughs> uh, probably not. Yeah, only ten people so far. What else am I doing? Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Working on that. Visit the beach before... Five. Well, we've got time. Let's go down. Oh, gotta say hi. Ah, uh, Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. Yes, I will. I like animals. Uh, that's Abigail. I don't want to talk to Abigail. Oh, it's Mayor Lewis! Hi, Mayor Lewis! So, how was your first night in the old cottage? Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. Well, you can replace a bed. It has nothing to do with the house. <laughs> but, yeah, I definitely will do some upgrading at some point. Yeah. All this sunshine is bad for my skin. Ahoy there, miss. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. Yeah? Uh, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul! I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Uh, okay, thanks. Uh, I'm not going to do fishing right away this time. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Yes, uh, that's nice. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. So come by if you need supplies. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> that's what my old pappy used to say anyway. I keep yawning. It, it, it's... Uh, interrupting my stuff. Alright. So, got a fishing pole. Uh, I'm just... Oh yeah, that's right. I don't, I don't have all the room. So... We should go put some stuff to be sold. 
I'm also checking the clock and uh, I'm starting to think that yeah, two days per episode is yeah, a pretty good uh, amount of time. I'm pretty sure that'll come out to just over 30 minutes or 40 minutes or something like that. Any other forage I can get out here before I before I get up into my farm? Oh, hello there. Hello, it's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Oh, uh, thank you, Leah. Uh, spring is nice. It's spring here in the uh, Pacific Northwest. So, uh, that's rather nice. Hello. I wonder if you can fix that. I'm pretty sure you can. It's like a bridge or something, right? Here's the old decrepit hat shop. Let's see anything up here? I just want some forage. Uh, where be all the forage? There we go. Oh, yeah, I'm inventory full. Okay, then. Well, then, let's head back. Yep, 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 yep. Back to the farm, maybe clear out some junk. Let's see, de definitely going to sell that sap. I don't really need the sap for anything right now. All right. Up here. There we go. And I'm going to keep the grass growing. It'll probably grow out of control, but uh, I like it. All right. That's a rock. There we go. Uh, da, 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 da. Clearing out the weeds. I might start out uh, with mining as my first um, big industry, my big money maker. Because you can find some really sweet stuff in the mines. You know, you are digging around in those sand pits. You can find artifacts, which are really cool. Okay. 4.30, feeling exhausted. Uh, yeah, let's throw some stuff in the bin then. Um, not what I meant to do. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Uh, I should, I want to make a chest. Can I make a chest yet? Let's see. Crafting. Chest. Yay. Uh, oops. There we go. I forgot. You, can, you put it in your inventory and then you place it. Uh, right there next to the TV. There we go. Fishing pole goes in there. Um, scythe can go in there. Watering can I want to keep on me. Uh, hoe, axe, pickaxe. Yeah, that's pretty good. So I'm gonna just do a little inventory management. If you've ever played Minecraft, then uh, you know inven inventory management is a must. And the pickaxe always goes in slot two. I don't care what anybody else says. That's how I do it. And that's how I like it. And as we all know, 
this channel. I do it for me. But I like having you along. Because your company is really nice. All right. It's getting really close to seven. So let's, let's just go ahead and check out the weather report for tomorrow. Uh, rain. I like rain. I like rain because I don't have to water my parsnips. All right. Time for bed and that and this is going to be the end of the episode. So I hope you all have a wonderful evening or morning or night or whatever the time is where you are. Uh right now it's night. So I'm going to bed. Good night. Yes. Ooh. A few coins for that forage. Yay. Good night.